Hey guys, it's Queen Bija, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 11 of Honey Mia. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. It's like, ugh. Oh, it's snowing, ah. Oh. Yeah, only child, sorry. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> she actually adorable. <laughs> oh god, my fucking allergies. <laughs> Don't make me sneeze today, god. <laughs> Uh-huh. Oh, he's so pretty. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> oh, damn. <laughs> Ow. Hi, honey. Nothing, don't worry about it. Oh, he's <laughs> me. Oh, that's his baby. He's so cute. Yeah, you guys kind of look the same height. But then when you look at them, they still kind of look the same height. But it's cute. Aww. <laughs> I know. Who would have thought, right? So cute, you know, Pop gave him a guy.
Thank you, Alexa. I'll get it after I'm done. Maybe you should just go home. Yeah, go home. Remember, don't yell at her. Oh. Yeah, so just go home now. Okay, you can thank him later. So now we're just going to stalk him for the rest of the episode. <laughs> no, he... <laughs> That laugh, I can't. If people talk about my laugh. <laughs> no, she really just wants to talk to you and probably say thank you. Yeah, but still, you said it. And do you not know how, like, upsetting that is to say to someone? Whether it's a freaking child, teenager, whoever.
Yeah, what is that going to do for you? Really, for him, honestly. Yeah. Just tell him. Damn it. Hitting your brother isn't going to solve anything, Moto. But you can still change and prove everyone wrong, sweetie. Mm. Oh, I just want to hug her. Oh. And just because you get into a lower ranking school doesn't mean that you're bad. Something also tells me easy me is here, maybe. Mm-hmm. Because <laughs> of course, boyfriend got to be over to help. That sweet home Alabama, honey. <laughs> I can't. Oh. That's sweet. No. Uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> I mean, outside the school, yes.
Excuse me. Mm-mm. <laughs> Maybe pick her favorite color. He's so fucking cute. Like, stop it. Seriously. <laughs> She's adorable, and I hope she does well in her exams. I mean, we've all been there. Especially, you know, from elementary school, high school, college, whatever. You know, taking exams is literally the most stressful thing ever. <laughs> it really is. I always hate it. I love learning, but I hate taking exams. I get too, like up in my head and ish and then I have like mm. there was one time I had a panic attack and it was only because I was doing my um my CNA exam and that's when you know you're in front of people and they don't say anything to you so you have to figure out what you did wrong all by yourself and you have to tell them what you did wrong and really when they're just staring at you and like eyes are just beaming uh it's the worst thing ever but I can't imagine like especially like when I go into school because I do want to go to school and better my education and everything um everything that I have to learn and such because it is very stressful for anybody and I mean especially the college kids who are currently in school now especially with our current situation you know having a pandemic and getting stressful over that and then everything else but yeah I think Malta's gonna do okay she's gonna be fine I mean shoot like he did something nice like really honestly they have like the cutest freaking relationship ever even though you know when he is in school he's all loud and about but when he's out and just hanging out with friends or even with his family he's really quiet and I mean like that's me kind of in a nutshell even though like when I'm very shy into myself and such so let's say like any one of y'all <laughs> Whether here in America or anywhere I go, Japan, anywhere, if you meet me probably the first time, I'm a little quiet and shy and I'm like, I don't know if they're going to like me. Because <laughs> I always like sometimes think outside and I think a little too much because, you know, ish. we all have done that. And so it takes me a little while to um, warm up to people and eventually show people like, yeah, I'm loud and da da da, da this is that and third. I don't always like it when like someone who was very loud and obnoxious kind of comes up to me because then I'm all like this and I'm like, uh-uh, like no, like shut the fuck up. <laughs> because the differences between my mom and me is she's a social butterfly and I'm someone who is quiet as fuck and I can be like, I, I can just slowly but surely have a conversation with you um, and everything. And then once we find something that we're both into, then yeah, you're going to see a different side of me. But my mom, like especially with this situation and everything, it's not only hard on her, but anybody else who is a social butterfly and it sucks 
because she wants to have so many different conversations with so many different people whether it's people she knows and people she doesn't and because of our current you know panorama pandemic situation it kind of really just sucks for her so she doesn't get the social butterfly norm that she is used to and so sometimes she possibly never gets it sometimes she just only gets it with me and or even um anyone else who she has the chance to call someone if she is able to because you know everyone outside of like us and shit we're all busy with our lives and everything even with the fucking pandemic but yeah this is a really cute adorable episode i'm glad you know she asked honey <laughs> And to, you know, uh, tutor his sister and everything. I just hope she does really well. So maybe next week we might get, like, an answer on how she did for her exams and everything. But I think, what, yeah, next week's the final episode, which sucks. Because I, <laughs> I don't want this show to end. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 11 of Hori Mia. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every, uh, every single day. Join the Magical Squad, of course. I will see you guys officially, y'all, next Saturday for the final episode. Bye, guys.